Hey guys, it's uh, Terrip up here, and today I am assembling an Orange Pi 5 16 gig board with a acrylic case. You can buy these as a kit. Uh, they come with heat sinks, fan. Well, actually, this is the fan. This is a, a Geek Pi fan that's LED. I'm going to swap it out. It's a 30 by 30 by 10. Um, this has all the screws and then um, this over here is going to be a 256 gigabyte 2030 sorry 2230 m.2 in VME and I'm gonna add that to the bottom of the board so let me go ahead and get the uh, the parts out and we will start assembling this okay so the kit that I bought from uh, AliExpress came with these heat sinks and this is for the CPU the two 8 gig memories. This board has a total of 16. And then over here, I'll have to look that up. I believe that's the SPI. But no, the SPI is back here. I'll look it up. But that's how uh, it should be. We could put two more back here on these. But it only comes with the four. So I'm going to go ahead and pull off the tape. There's already. Uh, thermal tape on these so once I pull it off I'll just have to stick them on there all right so we got our heat sinks on there so now we're gonna flip her over and we're gonna go ahead and connect that 2230 uh, storage here okay and we'll show you what that looks like all right so I have the uh, Samson NVMe in place. Uh, luckily, I had an old PCI board that came with extra connectors for the um, storage. Um, <clears throat> one thing that's kind of missing, um, I wish they came with uh, something where you could use it, but this is working out pretty good. It's now in there nice and secure, and the pins are all there. So, the next thing to do is to take off all the acrylic over here. Alright, <clears throat> so we got all the uh, protective film off of the acrylic. And we're going to start with the base. These are the, the sides, this is the top. And again, the side. And um, again, I'm going to use this fan to re uh, replace the one it came with. If you can find a tool like this, I would highly recommend for these hex, hex pieces. And we're gonna start off with these uh, decorative hex screws. Those are gonna be the feet. And then these will be the, um, the posts that the boards will sit on. And then believe it or not, these taller standoffs are going to be the uh, sides and then the screws are going to put it on top all right so let's go ahead and get the base and we'll uh, then secure the uh, pie with uh, these standoffs so again the uh, smaller standoffs with the uh, hex bolts okay all right so we got the base down now we will line up the holes and we're going to take the standoffs. Go ahead and get this started. Okay. Now I'm going to, whoops, that one's kind of crooked. I'm going to tighten these down and then I'm going to assemble the sides and then we'll put the top on, okay? 
All right, so as you can see, we have the sides on. So now, save some time. I went ahead and hooked up the fan. I'm, I got my power closest to the 26 pin out pin. And then once we set this on top, all we have to do is align the uh, the notches with the, uh, the case and then put the screws in and we're done. All right. And there's our acrylic case that you get with the orange pies. Very nicely done. Again, this blue fan, I'll, or blue LED fan will look nice. I actually ordered two. So I did an extra modification. I wanted to have um, them together. So I use extra standoffs to connect them so that it's one unit. And then on the second pie I ordered, it was actually another kit that came with a wireless card, and that's what's on the bottom of this. So one of them's got storage, okay? And one of them has the wireless. And I'll boot it up here in a second. All right, so here's the case assembled, and I got it hooked up with a power supply and video. We'll be booting it up here in a Well, it's booting up right now, but we'll show the recording here in a second. Uh, Logitech keyboard, and for now, we're on this one, we are using Ethernet. The whole reason I swapped out the fan that came with the case was I really like these um, LEDs they really uh, are nice and again this is a 30 by 30 by 10 millimeter 5 volt fan and we got it plugged into the uh, 4 and 6 pins so looking really good and got a lot of activity so Let's take a look at it booting up, but guys, this essentially is just a, was a quick tutorial on how to put the case together.